The 101 report is the schedule of fixed assets by source and is one of four GAAP reports. Source means the fund the item was originally charged to when it was purchased. This may or may not be the same fund where the item is currently being used. To explain this, we're going to look at the acquisition transaction record. The 101 uses the PO information from the acquisition record to identify the source fund used in purchasing the item. The source fund is fund 300. This item was paid with this fund. The where used fund is specified in item screen. This will determine what fund type, whether governmental, proprietary, or fiduciary, the item will be reported under on the 101 report. The where used fund is, is like I said, 001. This is a governmental fund type. So the amount of this item will be included with source fund 300, and 300 will be displayed under the fund type of governmental on the 101 report. Now we're going to run the 101. If you have any entity IDs you wish to exclude from the 101 report, you can enter them here. For further information on entity IDs, please refer to the entity ID video. The program will generate two files. It will generate an EIS 101 text file and possibly an EIS AIR file. Each fund type is printed on a separate page. You'll notice fiduciary funds, and then on page 2, governmental funds. Page 3 would be proprietary, and there will be an, an extra page uh, for unknown fund types. So if we look down at the governmental funds, it displays the source fund. Now this is from the acquisition record. For our example, it was 300. And then the total amount, which is the original cost for all of the items within that fund. An additional page, as I mentioned, may be printed for assets with unknown fund types. Please refer to the EIS 101 AIRS video for more information on assets with unknown fund types, acquisitions prior to system startup information, and the EIS 101 errors found on the EIS error report. To help in balancing at the end of the fiscal year, the totals for each fund type on the 101 should match the totals on the 102 and the 103 reports. Please refer back to the video selection for videos on the other EIS gap reports.